when I hear these things about let's make America great again, and I think to myself, well, exactly when did you think America um, was great? We're not going to make America great again. It was never that great. There's things that are savagely wrong in this country. What we're seeing in this country doesn't reflect our spirit. What we're seeing in this country doesn't reflect, reflect our potential. Raise your hand if, gover if your government plan would provide coverage for undocumented immigrants. Yes, we're supposed to be for a 70% tax rate on the wealthy. You hear folks say there's not enough money. What I say to them every single time is there's plenty of money in this world. There's plenty of money in this country. It's just in Thank the wrong you. hands. When you're white, you don't know what it's like to be living in a ghetto. You don't know what it's like to be poor. We're in late phase capitalism and we know it doesn't work and we've got to move into something new. And I believe in community ownership of land, labor, resources and distribution of those resources. And so whatever that morphs into, I think is what will serve community the best. And I'm excited to usher it in by any means necessary. Any means necessary. This liberal will be all about socializing. Uh, um would be about basically taking over and the government running all of your companies. Raise your hand if you think it should be a civil offense rather than a crime to cross a border without documentation. <laughs> can we keep the hands up so we can see them? No Trump, no wall, no USA at all. No Trump, no wall. Making fun of members of Congress are a disgrace. And there's no need for anyone to think that is unacceptable. We're going to shut them down and work with whoever it is to shut them down, and they should be prosecuted. I want them shut down. I want them silenced. I want them <laughs> muted. I think they are horrible for our society. And so, folks, look, if you start off with the notion there's nothing you can do, well, might you all go home then, man? Or let's start a real physical revolution if you're talking about it. A so-called anti-fascist website is encouraging, quote, all manner of physical violence against Trump supporters and capitalists. Today we are lifting up these stories in the hopes that you will see the light. And if you don't, we will bring the fire. Yo, yo! After arriving in the emergency room, I had a CT scan, which confirmed that I was diagnosed with a brain hemorrhage. Yeah!